Okay, this is uh, Soto Desperado, aka John Greer. Um, I got this new software for recording, so I thought I'd maybe try another hardcore map. <laughs> I, uh, you know, another local. <laughs> I'm hoping this records properly. The last time I tried it, I lasted about uh, three uh, episodes on um i think it was valgaro here it is i was on valgaro now i could start again on valgaro but uh, i made rookie mistakes that got me killed <laughs> so i i'm i'm in i'm inspired to maybe just pretend i didn't do that let's see delete single player <laughs> yeah i was going to try a different map i wanted to do the center and the center's okay. The thing is, it's kind of weird. There's a lot of water. And there are certain places that if you try to go there without fur armor, you're going to freeze to death regardless. And the nights are always cold. So, I don't know. I, I was thinking of just kind of uh, maybe trying something different. The Genesis ones, they were never my cup of tea. I did like the swamp on Genesis Part 1. But... Ugh, it's a it's a pain um so i don't know uh i don't know uh i wish some i get feedback for this but uh this is also counting as a test i'm not sure if it's recording properly uh i tested a little bit but not much so we'll go from here i'm going to try the center i haven't done the center in a long time it's still in hardcore mode Let's see, I think it's still in hardcore mode. Where's hardcore? No. Let's see, I'm hearing something in the background. Oh, it's just, I think it's just my fan. Anyway, um, it could be here. Here it is. Hardcore mode is enabled. So this will be a series for the center. That map is very, very, I mean, you'll have to do a boat just to, just to kind of stay alive. There's a lot of spawns everywhere. Most of the, um, there's one spot that I went to that I was exploring because it was kind of cool looking. It had a lot of old tombs and uh, not tombs, but uh, ruins. And uh, you can actually turn some of those ruins into a base if you really wanted to. So, I mean, I could try that again and see if it'll go. Um, should be too bad. Um, yeah, we'll do the center. Valgaro. Let's see how many episodes of the center I could do. I'll try not to do more than uh, maybe under an hour. I'm just going to get it started and then log out. So hopefully this will work. So first episode is going to be fairly short. Not like the other ones where it was two hours. I'm also testing to make sure that um, it records it. There we go. So we'll do random. No, mama. Oh, my cat's always there. Chief Ladas. Chifladas. Anyway, let's see. Uh, 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 uh. Uh, that's too much neck for me. No. Uh, too Popeye. Uh, this is more like it. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. There I am. <laughs> Now, let's see, Tropical, Easy, I think those are kind of hard there, but it's like anything else. If you don't have a good flyer, you don't have fur armor, you don't have enough resources in your environment, you have to move on to where they are. So, we could start in the Easy or the Medium. Uh, medium... Redwood Forest. No, I'm not big into Redwood. Snow. Yeah, you want to stay away from Lava Snow because that's bad. 
I guess I can try to do mamas. No mamas. My cats. Get over. Get over there. Anyway, um, I guess we can try to do the jungles north. Survivor name Soto. And hopefully this recording will work. And we'll create a new survivor and see what happens. Hmm. See if I get eaten. Now it's hardcore mode. Wow. Oh, man, I hope this thing's recording properly. Is it me or is everything kind of weird? I guess. Oh, it must be the settings. Well, anyway, at least it looks pretty decent. Uh, let's see, Gamma 4. Always do Gamma 4 if you can. And uh, let's see, let's get some tools going here. Alright, gotta find some loose rocks. Some rocks on the beach, maybe. There we go. Try to get that done. These little rocks here will have some metal in them once we get going. Uh, best thing to do in most cases. See, there's a spino right over there. Shit. That's as powerful as a Rex. Let's see. Oh, well, my cat wants to be petted. That's good. It's 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 good to want to be wanted by somebody. I'll tell you, that's why you get a pet. You feed them, you take care of them, they love you back. You feed people, you have kids, and you feed them, they're going to hate your ass. <laughs> Mama, why didn't you do this? And why didn't you do that? Nah, nah, nah. Let's see. Oh, wow. I think I spawned in a nice place, even though it, technically it's medium. Uh, there is a river there. I've been down that river before. Like when you go down there with that boat, you better go fast and you better keep going. Oh, I don't have a bola or anything. Let's see. 23 and that one. I don't know what over there. That's a 23, and this one is a 23 as well. Okay. So it doesn't make any much sense. Any much sense at all. What you doing, baby? Everybody wants to be loved. Okay. Let's do two of those. Okay. Get some clothes going. Get this. Put this here. Get some more clothes going. I don't like being without clothes. Shirt. Cover it up, Mr. Greer. Yeah, all right. Oh, yeah, I use my real name. Shouldn't do that online. Okay. So, let's get some flint from one of these stones. Yeah, that spino over there, that's a big thing. It's as big and powerful as a rex. You can even say it's worse. In a way. Because it can stand up and give you a rake attack. I use them all the time. That's why I know. Let's see what else. Oh, it's gone. Let's take a peek. Ooh, there's oil right there. Look at that. Those are oil notes. Oh. Oh, crap. That was a piranha. <laughs> <laughs> Did 
the damn piranha. We'll do the traditional thing. I didn't see it coming. I didn't see it coming from anywhere. Let's eat some food. Try to heal up. It's going to take a while to heal up, so it's not going to be done quickly. But there's no other predators. But anyway, there's oil down there, if you can get to it. Uh, let's do that. Uh, let's see. Okay. Let's see what we can construct. Got that. Got one of those. Alright. Okay, we got a berry eater there. Oh, man. Oh, there's dodos over there. I think I'll go get a dodo and start making some food. You get some basic food and you'll be able to survive better. Hey, Dodo. There we go. So I put the thing down here. Hopefully the Spino won't creep up. You know, I bet the Spino went the opposite direction because when I looked in there, I couldn't see it. Let's see. Okay, there's something over there. I don't know what it is. Let me go ahead and just make some of these things. I'm already in the hot seat. Oh, it's just a... Oh, it's one of those flying pets. Those are good because they, you can send them out to attack things and they fly. They're like flying lizards. I, I used to breed them and they mutate pretty good and they work pretty good. You have a bunch of them, what they'll do is they'll delay. Uh, you know, you can set them as like a diversion. You know, they're good for diversion. You can also be a shoulder pet. You know, they're pretty nice. Okay, let's put some of this wood in there. Put that in there. Don't need that. Do need this. Let's make some food. It's easier to, to replace with your nutrients with food. Level up. Let's get another foundation. That a door. Let's get some thatch going. And uh, hopefully it'll work out. It's one of those damn ducks over there. Those things attack the shit out of you. You've gotta be careful with them. Let's see. I don't think I can get the bolo yet. A bola. That'll come here. Level nine. Okay. Well, man, I hope this thing is recording. This is one of those freebie 30 day trials. Uh, the other one was a freebie 30 day trial and I liked it, but they wanted a lot. This one's only like 20 bucks. So if this works well, man, I'm going to keep this one. The other one, I think they wanted like 40 or 60 for that. For just the ability to record the screen, not really edit it. So I'm like, man, are you kidding me? Let's see. Okay, let's put that there. All right, that will help a lot. Thank you, Mr. Dodo. Now, I'm still overloaded. I got all these stupid skins I don't want to use for a damn thing. I can eat that. How come I got all this, though? Okay, well, let me see. I guess... What do I have? Oh yeah, that's right. I haven't put any points into weight. That stone's probably killing me. Uh, 
Come here. I need your flesh. Blah, 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 blah. I attack that thing, it's going to kill me. I'm also overweighted. There's that damn duck. It's a killer duck. Uh. Mm -mm. That's what I like about it. Oh, I'm already healed up. That's good. Some of the settings might be pro, you know, healing you up faster than normal, from what I can tell. You know? So I'm not surprised. Okay. Oh, come on. Now's when I need to level up again. All right, well, I might as well try to craft something. Let's see, shoes might help. And these bands. Okay. So we got a little bit of protection or, or up. So I got to put some points into weight. Oh, there's those damn things. I hate those damn things. Ducks. As long as they're in the water, it's no use even boloing them. Every time a bolo hits the water, see, there's that damn spino over there in the distance. It's just fooling around. I wish I had a spyglass so I can see what level it is. Even a low level spino, the way this thing is, is really, really good. Oh, that's an otter. There's an otter and an Hesperus, I think they're called. Those things are nasty. They will attack you. The otter's cool, though. But I, there's piranha in there, so me going in there after the otter with that piranha in there is not a good idea. It, uh, piranha almost killed me. So, I guess what we'll do is we'll get, uh, get some more stuff done. Let's see, did I make the box yet? I don't think I made the box. I should have made the box. That would have been smarter. Oh. Dude, that's like, wow. <laughs> Put it all in the box. Come on, man. I need another level. Give me another level. See, that gives me 30 minutes to pick that thing up, which isn't bad. Hmm, this thing's really disintegrating differently. No, maybe it's just me, I don't know. Oh, here's a level up. We'll put one in weight. And we'll get the box, because I forgot to get the box. We will not get a wooden sign. <laughs> or we'll save it up, because I want to get the bola. I need to make the box. So I take this back. Make the box. You can also make uh, some foundations while I'm at it. Place the box. Just put it here somewhere. Wait till I finish this up. Putting some of this stuff in there I don't really need. 
Because I can't make stone yet, but I will want to make stone. Eventually. And I'm going to want it in that box. There you go. So now we got a box. It's a box with an attitude, man. Box with an attitude. Oh, shit. Let's creep over here. Let's creep over here. What's over here? Oh, look. It's a... Uh, oh, shit. This is a natural... Oh, man. This would be good. As long as nothing falls on me from up there. You're pretty much good here. Look at that. It's a natural canopy. Uh, it's got... Oh, it's not sealed. That's a hole up there, so something can fall down on you. But you're you're covered by two ends. I need to hide. To survive as well as their pizza. The pizza. Hmm. Remember, this is going to be a short episode. I'm testing this new gear. If it works, then I'll keep working it and I'll probably buy it. It's only 20 bucks, which sounds pretty good. I just hope the quality is there. You know what I mean? Uh, if it is, great. If it isn't, well, shit. There's another dodo. Was oh, another one down here? Another dodo somewhere. Yeah, hide's important in the beginning so that you can, uh, you know, get your stuff uh, made. Like, a, you need a lot of hide for a boat or a raft, in my case. Uh, if I'm going to do that. See, it's good to explore this the center on a boat or raft. But, like I said, there's spinals in the water. As you can see, there's all kinds of stuff going on. Got weird weather, weird everything. It's so weird. Got to do that spamming of the food. Yeah, if I go exploring in that direction, best thing to do is get an animal to ride on if you're actually going to go. Because then you're using your, your animal stamina, not your stamina. As you try to do that, you try to run or whatever, it's going to be difficult. Uh-oh. Hello, Mr. Dodo. Goodbye, Mr. Dodo. I think I went up a level already. I heard another Dodo. Soto, the Dodo killer. No, I'm so sorry. I love the animals. I will not eat the meat. But I will kill this motherfucker here. Anyways. <laughs> Poor thing. Shit. I can't believe they put the dodos in this game. But is that If it wasn't a dodo, it would be like a chicken or something. Oh, there's another dodo over there. Go start cooking some more meats. Meats a pizza. Oops. My bad. All right. We got the box. Okay, I don't remember what level the thing was on, but I do know that 
I don't know if I want to be that close to the shore. No. Maybe I will move the the business up here and just try to not get eaten. I don't intend to, to do that. But the thing is, this only protects you. Technically, it protects you from two sides, technically. But, like, I can put down these things, like, in a row, like, from there to there. I can do this. I can do... Boom. All right. right follow the line and then fill it in and take care of these trees later on and then change it to stone or something oh shit it's those damn things I don't have a bola yet I need a bola I need a bola. Those things are dangerous. They don't look like much, but I'm telling you, they're sons of bitches. They're sons of bitches. Ah, get on a rock. Away from it. Away from the SOB. It's the beast. The beast. Right, 13th son. It's the beast. And it's a duck beast. Ah. Wait. Two weights. Do I get a bowler yet? Oh, thank you. Thank you. Narcotic. I'll need that. Yeah. Anyway, let's see. Oh, shit. Some of the bitches right by my... Damn it. Let me try to get some stones here. What else I need? Uh, hide, fiber, thatch. Shit. Okay. Fiber. Let's see if I can kill something. I killed most of the dodas and I put the damn hide in the box. Yeah, that's how I feel right now. I just took a poo. And I feel like I'm full of poo. You know why? Because of all these damn berries. Keep eating all these damn berries. Okay, let's see. What do we got? I just need a dodo so I can start making some bolas. There's a dodo. There's a dodo. Come here, bola potential. Come my bola potential. Here, dodo bola. Damn, I keep hearing that that sound. Oh, it's a damn otter. You feed these guys fish and they're a friend. Because they can help keep you uh, warm. Now, there, technically, I can make some. Here's seven. That's good. It's good. It's good. It's good. Let's see. I want these here. Okay. I could kill this one here and get him out of the damn way. Oh shit, shit, shit! Die, motherfucker! You beast! Beast! Got you, beast! I like this thing you get, uh, you get a little bit of polymer just like a, um, um, penguin. 
So I got a little bit of polymer. Not that I can use it right now. At least I don't think so. Let's get some more. Oh, my fire went out. Why did my fire go out? Light the fire. Thatch and fiber. Bola will save your life if you bother to use it, which I didn't do last time, which is why I wound up dead. gonna tame that one over there but I don't know if Bola will work on it I've never actually tamed one of those because I, I always see them with their little hands and I get scared because I think they're gonna come up and punch me with their little hands <laughs> see a parasaur won't do that parasaur is very chicken but that son of a bitch there I think he attacks you oh that spinal still over there shoot I don't think we've been on so far too long. Let's see. Let me get some more stone. All right. Make another box. And we'll start working on more thatch. Try to enclose that area over there. And um, go from there. I might be able to get one of those pterodons and convert them through the miracle of smacking. So I got plenty of bowl and I got 10. That should be enough for most things. Let's see. Let me get this, this guy here. Problem is I haven't had any bugs or anything, so... You don't need a club. You can just use your bare fists. <laughs> it's crazy, 13 son. It's crazy. Put some meat on him. He'll be happy. Replace my lost Bola. I don't know if I'm going to get that guy over there, but I think that guy is a, a berry collector, whatever you want to call it. There we go. So we should be taming up. I just got to watch it. It's only a level 5. Maybe I can use it to attack remotely. I can't ride it without a, a chitin based saddle. And dodos don't give you chitin or keratin. So. I'm getting my, my inner ape man. Let's see, how do I team this guy? I think I can bolo him. Here's the thing though, I bolo him, and it doesn't bola, he's gonna kill me. So that is the thing. So let's see. Alright, okay.
I'd hit you in the face, but I don't want to upset you. Okay. Well, that worked. I hope I can make the saddle for that guy. I never use those. I don't even know what they're called. Iguanodons, that's what they're called. I remember now. I think it'll tame with berries. Probably Miho berries. Knowing my luck. I can put Miho. It is taming. Oh wow, it tames so fast. Damn. I'm surprised. I don't know what I can do with it. It's so low level, it probably won't be able to do shit. But, hmm. And the Pterodon, if I can find him. Oh shit, he tamed. I'm going to call him Striker. Because that's all I'll be able to use him for. Oh crap, that, I named the wrong one. Okay, no, no. Hold on. I'm going to put behavior. Uh, and neutral. And let's see. I don't have a saddle for him. There's no way I'm going to get a saddle. And then this one. Put him on neutral too. Let him follow me around for a while. Till I figure out at what level the Iguanodon saddle is. Jeez. It's so creepy. Look at his hands. He's got hands, but his thumbs are like these things he wants to stick in your eye. They're like they're like these talons he wants to stick in your eye. Oh, he wants to stick them in your eye. Oh. Anyway, yeah, this is hardcore mode, the center, in case anybody's wondering. And, uh, yeah. Like, I like to have plenty of bolas. Let's go up a level. Let's see, we'll do more weight. Iguanodon, Iguanodon. Igua Iguanodon saddle. I think that says 30. Yeah, I'm probably going to have to wait till I'm level 30 for this guy. So, behavior disable following. You can just stay there and look pretty. They're on neutral, so let me go ahead and behavior uh, medium to. Hi, I'm going to change it to a high follow distance. That'll give me a little bit more play. Some more Mitsa. Eat these berries, eat these berries. Eat these berries, eat these berries. Yay! Well, I'm glad that worked out. Go team, go. So I got extra bolas there. So now I'll get Burke, uh, back to uh, making uh, thatch stuff. I need thatch. I need wood, right? Yeah, wooden fiber. I got fiber here. No, I'll keep that in storage. I'm going to get new fiber. Let's see. Thatch. I forgot I need to... Need to repair this thing. I'll repair this thing too. See, at night it gets kind of cold. Uh oh, that thing might be running from something.
See, if if I have this pterodon's annoying, but if I get spontaneously attacked, e, it's on neutral, so it will attack and intercept whatever it is that's trying to get me. You know, it's better than, in other words, it's better than not having anything in here to do anything with. Oh, it's a last rose. Put taming food in the slodge. I got him. Look at that. Uh, I'll put him up in here. He's probably safer in here. And I'll just... Uh, I'll name him. Let's see. I'll disable following. And I'll pet it. There we go. He's a fun thing. Uh, harvest setting. What? What harvest? Okay. Change name. I want to call him Larry. Just because I like Larry's name. Okay. What do we got? Let's make some foundations. Let's get some more weight. Oh, wow. I'm telling you, it's the way of the beast. The way of the beast. Oh God, I got so much, so much I got to do. So instead of making a wall or making stone dinosaur gates, which is what I would normally put here to eliminate any possibility of things messing with me, what I do is... Um, I'll just put foundation since it's so flat. You see how it's perfectly flat? It's not messing with you in any way. And that's the best thing to do. And I can use these trees to make... Ooh, that's like 14 more. Yeah. So up there, there's creatures that can fall in. But right now I just need some protection because raptors can come very easily here along the beach. They like to go along the beach and mess with you. See, I haven't wasted any of my meat yet. I'm just eating berries. Getting wood of extra excess berry weight. There. So that helped a little bit. And I can get rid of this. Oh, man. My back's hurting a little bit. I'm not in a good position. So, I'm going to go ahead and put down another one of these. Now here's where it's not even anymore. So you can do something else with that. You can make a ceiling. Oh, I need more thatch. You can make a ceiling. Sometimes if you put a ceiling on it and then you try to put like a uh, foundation underneath it, sometimes it'll take it and it didn't. Okay. So I probably need to, to get a pillar made. Maybe a wooden pillar. There's a wooden pillar. Need one. I think I can get this. I think I can. I think I can. So we got this. We got this. So we got that. And then I think you can put. It should align. Oh, I don't remember. Let's 
see, it goes here. I'm trying to get it to align. Okay, there's that. And let's pick this up. And we'll go ahead and put down one of these. There we go. There. You see? The pillar helps to align the next level of foundation. And I knew I could do that. Let's put this back in here. And boom, you see? I pick up the pillar. And I'll do the same thing here. Put this down. And then try to put down another foundation. Supposed to be able to go. See, it doesn't want to go. Okay. Let's see. Yeah, this thing's not snapping very nice. Should I make another pillar? No, I can't. Any more wood? Get some more wood then. There's wood. Make another couple of boxes while I'm at it since I'm here. Get some more weight. Hope my tame over there is good. But it doesn't matter if this thing doesn't work. There's a wooden wall. See if I can finish this up. Okay. Oh yeah, that's right. Let me see. Oh, I, I forgot to make the damn thing. <laughs> All right. That's a big hole in the ground over there. Okay, got a couple of pillars. Put one. Let's see, can I can I jump? No. Put one here. No, that's not working. That's one. Supposed to be able to snap it, but it's not snapping because it's got like a, yeah, because it's a different level. Shit! Come on, man! Oh wait, wait, wait! Wait, 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 wait! There we go. There we go. That's what I wanted. I pick this up. Ah, shit. Anyway. So, now that I've got that, let's go back to weight. Let's go ahead and put down a couple of those things over here. Like way, way in here. I'll put some, uh, some of these. And I'll recreate my base here. I still got some foundations I can put down with. What I could do is make like a another miniature wall here and uh, see I made another wall so I have an outer wall and I'll have an inner wall uh, lined with foundations and I can upgrade the foundations later to something else. But for now, what I could do is make a bunch of walls. So let me get this wood. See? That way I at least have something between me and the rest of the universe out here. Let's see. I only got three. I got one. I'll put, I'll put that as a doorway. 
now. Now, as to getting my tames over here, I'll have to just chill out here for a bit. I want to be able to do that. Oh, wow, did you guys see that? Oh, a oh, glitch. What a glitch. Glitched into the wall. Anyway, see, that's one layer of something. I'm glad Striker's all hoiled up on there. He got stuck already. See how he got stuck? That's what happens when you have a dino on follow. So this is like a cheap artificial wall. It's not really designed to do much. Let me try to get um, Man, I hope this is recording. Wooden ramp is fine. And um there we go. And, um, don't need more wood. That's the thing about wood. You need to always need a lot of wood for wood. But by the time I'm done, this beach will be cleared out. And I'll have to move on to something else. So, what I'll do... Oops. No, no, no. Make a couple of those. I haven't seen shit so far. My meat should still be cooking. And let's see, I got a thatch thing here. I'm definitely gonna put a ramp here. A ramp on the other side. Yeah. That way I don't have to jump up anymore, come down, come up, in and out. Just like a house, but it's a wall. And I need to change the thatch foundation to something uh, wood or stone. Normally, I hold off on doing any major structures and I wait till I am able to work with stone. I don't fool around with that. I just wait. Um, but in this case, it may be an exception to the rule. Okay, you know what? Uh, I'll demolish this one. You might be able to get out. See, if there's a dino up there and then it sees me, it'll jump down. That's why I don't want to be completely exposed but this would be a good area here for any tames and um, there's a special way I'm going to do it so I can allow them in and make like a zigzag cage so we'll do that all right let's check the food see I managed to dislodge him All right, so we actually have more food than we need. Let's see, put that away. Let's put some more food in there since I'm still in the area before I transfer out. All right, I'll put some wood in there. All right. So I got plenty of meat and I got all these berries because I've been collecting stuff. Eat all the berries first. I normally leave Miho berries, but I'm not taming anything actively. I just grabbed this guy because he was there. 
Too bad his his thing is too much. Uh, I'm gonna up his weight because his health is shit anyway. Nothing I do to his health is really gonna help him. Maybe I should have put the berries on him. That would have been smarter. Let's get some more wood. Oh shit, I did need the fiber. I forgot wood takes fiber. So we'll just pick more fiber. We don't have um, anything great yet. Just the first day. Thankful I managed to survive that piranha. Because I kept hearing it and hearing it and I couldn't see anything attacking me. And sure enough, it was a damn piranha. Snuck up to the side probably. Started nipping me in the butt. Stop hurting my butt, piranha. I am offended by your intrusion. And I hope I don't see a damn raptor. But, I mean, I can get it. I can get it. It's just I'm not going to make the mistake I did last time. <laughs> Let me give him the berries. This is the berries I don't need. Okay. What else we need? Or wood. Matter of fact, let me get you out of here. Behavior enable flower. Let's see. I never really rode an Iguanodon. I always just ignored them. I ignored them and I preferred the Parasaur. So I never used it. So I'm like, mm, I guess I have to learn to use it now. Mm-mm-mm. See, it looks a lot better now. Uh, normally, like I said, I'll use stone. And this is the outer layer. Let's see. So, oh yeah. Let's see. Can you go up here? See, I was going to put ramps. I'm going to put ramps on one end. A couple of ramps there right against the wall you know just enough for you to get over it and then I'll put another layer wall there let's see put it here and here and anybody can get over it even my, my boy can get over it now there we go so I'll bring him over here to the inner sanctum and I'll disable his following And uh, I don't have any more berries for him. That'll keep him tight for now. And what I do, Mr. Magoo, is I'll put a wall there. And I'll finish up this area over here. This, what I do is I'll leave it open until I learn to do like a wooden dinosaur gate or something. Let's see, is that even available yet? Large storage box important. Wooden raft is important because I want to go exploring. Even if I, well, I'll probably die going exploring. exploring. But there you go. Anything else that I need that's pressing stone arrow bow um, cooking pot I don't really need spyglass I need I kept forgetting that oh no 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 don't need that I'm just gonna do one character <laughs> I keep forgetting uh, don't need spark powder 
Okay, so I'm going to save up. I got 31 Ingram points. I don't need any of this fancy armor just yet. Maybe later. So let me make some of this. Yeah, some boxes, some bigger boxes. Let's see. I need some wood. Put some more weight on. Okay. Yeah, that thing that's across over there, crawling on the beach, that thing is pure keratin. It is it is like a bunch of s spiky keratin, like spikes. So it's basically bone, a lot of bone. And bone and chitin, uh, they're compatible. So you can use bone or chitin to make a saddle for this guy. Which I don't think is high enough level to really carry me. I don't even think he'd carry me naked over there. But uh, that's what they do. Let's put some of these on the inner sanctum. The inner sanctum, sir. Let's see. We'll just put them back here like that. There we go. So what I'll do is I'll, I'll put more foundations down and extend the wall out because it doesn't have to be that far. I'll probably put like maybe three layers of foundations. Still have enough room in between these two layers for my babies. And go from there. All right. Go team go. Go team go. So far, nothing else has uh, manifested. So far, so good. Wait. Didn't help me any. Oh yeah, I'm out of fiber. Shit. Okay. Do this, drop it. Come back over here. Pick up some of that fiber. Pick the weight back up. Eat the berries. Eat the berries. Eat the berries. Drop those. Okay. And then foundations instead. I gotta start transferring that crap off the beach and bring it over here. The animal. I don't even have a saddle for that damn iguanodon. Uh oh. Shit. That's an RG. It's attacking an RG. I bet the, the RG tried to come get me and he intercepted. You see how he intercepted? Because he was just following me around. He wouldn't do anything. But since he's on neutral and that thing targeted me, sure enough, it took him out. If I had, if I try to tank, tangle with that thing, oh shit, man. Yeah, you can't bolo that. Oh, shit. And it's right between me and my stuff. And it's coming over here. Man. Shit. <laughs> yeah, let me craft a bow. 
I don't have any narc or anything. No mamas. My cat keeps coming over here. Don't do that, Baba. <sighs> what a chiflada. Okay. Get screwed off. Let me go get my shit out of there. Poor baby. <laughs> he dropped some meat. Okay. Oh shit. The good thing is I could eventually build a cage and try to get him in a cage, but it's a bitch. Especially when you're not in an elevated position. Just gotta be careful when him or one of his friends doesn't come by. But see, I got that stone on top, and I think it's going to go to the other side of the river. So we're good there. Anyway, it's going to put um, a couple more ramps here. And uh, let's see what I was going to do. Put a wall here. And uh, just a wall. Uh, every little bit helps. Let's see, so I'm gonna get my stuff off the beach and put all my stuff in here for now. Oops, those things in there, and that's what I'm gonna do. I gotta go get some water at the beach anyway. The bird's eye view, but no bird, so that's that works for me. He must have screwed off somewhere. Oh damn, let me get some water. When you run a lot you you drink more water. I don't like making those leather things unless I'm gonna make dyes or something. Oh there's the son of a bitch right there. Alright, opportunity to get this shit out of here. Okay. Right. I can dump all this stuff in those storage bins and then go kind of sort it out later. Now normally what I do is I make uh, spike walls. Uh, even wooden spike walls is better than nothing and that helps to provide a divide. Okay, now that's good. That one's good. I like that one. See, those things are small. They can become pets. Well, looks like Striker met his end. At least I think I met Striker. See, there he is. See, he'll hang around. He'll probably migrate down the beach. The only other thing is, like, when you're on the ground level like this, right, alphas can come get you. And alpha is like a super powerful dinosaur. An alpha dinosaur. Like I said, mamas, get off of there, mama. No, mama, get off of there. God, my cat's still screwing around. Okay, so it's taming. Let me make sure I got narco berries. Never mind. 
to see uh let's see break uh, point break <laughs> like the movie Anyway, so these guys are good pets. Behavior. Now nah, leave it. Attack my turtle. I don't know. I'm gonna sacrifice his ass. Or better yet, I'll tell you what. Neutral. Now there's nothing else out here for me. But I do need to get a few things. No. Not getting it from there. So what I normally do, just like I did on the other video, if you guys saw the other videos, I'll create a boat and I'll go around the beaches collecting whatever resources are... Whatever resources are on the beach. I thought I heard something. Hmm. I'm so sure I heard something. Anyway, um, oh, there's a drop over there. See, if I had the boat, I can try to go over there and get it. So, until I get that boat done. Ain't gonna be doing much. Can always come back here. What I'll do this time is um, since there's not much of a landmark here, is I'll make an artificial one out of pillars, so that when I see the pillars, I know that I'm at my uh, my um, beachhead right here. Now, oh wait. Now I know I had wooden spike walls here somewhere. Here, that's what that's what I need for anything on the ground. And it won't help much with an alpha, but it's better than nothing. We got the raft. A feeding trough is always handy. Uh, other shit I don't need. Yeah, I got a lot of levels to go before I can find anything else useful. Try to hold on to those points. 57 points will go a long way. Okay. Wooden spike wall. But I'd rather make the boat first. What else do I need? Fiber. Let's make the boat first. Nothing in there. I don't have enough wood. Shoot. I can't believe I don't have enough wood. Okay, I'm gonna go put this boat down when it's done. Or this raft. I keep calling it a boat, but it's a raft. And hope that nothing comes over here and bites my ass in a naughty way. They said that when I looked in the water, I saw those oil nodes down there, and I was like, wow, that's very damn convenient. Because usually it's kind of hard to find those. Okay, let's do this. You have to go up to the water, right click on the boat, and then you can place it. Once you place it, you can get on it and everything. 
uh, options, hide sale. I never use the sale. I like actually seeing what I'm doing. And I made one of these so I can place some of the materials. I don't really need much here. And then that's it. Let's pause the game for a second. Go to rest. Be right back. All right, so I set up a thing for my cat, or one of my cats, and the thing is he took it, but he's outside in the cold when he really shouldn't be. And that's uh, that might be a Trodon over there. That thing going round and round in the, in the water, that's usually a Trodon. So anyway, so I got a pet. And worst comes to worst, I just throw it at him and run like hell. Wow. That's real good granite stone there. <laughs> Yeah, I'll just go around the beaches and I'll have like several cabinets and I'll fill them with crap and then I'll, I'll manufacture whatever I need and go from there. See, so I can get more metal from these round rocks than I do anything else. Quiet man. Let's see. So let's see. Uh, I can't make a uh, forge yet. Can't make a forge. It's coming up. Pretty soon I will. Oh. I already got the level, just haven't used it. Okay. 
Make some metal stuff. Forge. Smithy. That's where the points are really needed. Mark arrow. Alright, so and do I have points for the mortar and pestle? I think I do. Yes, I do. Mark it. Okay. Alright, so there you go. Go team. So, so in the beginning, I'm looking for resources like, um, I'm looking for stuff like, um, crystal. I'm looking for obsidian, for some hard poly for later on, things like that. Oh, this poor guy. I think that would mean this. No, that just gonna say I get more snow layer. Take that. And I think I took all the hide with me. I'll put the pillars and some foundations over there. And take this with me. Days. You're staying. That's why I wish the best for you. I'll go for a ride uh, and then we'll go from there. I don't have any hide, so I have to be patient. We need a lot more wood. Uh, let's see. Let's put. I'm gonna put a couple of pillars here, and that should mark it. As long as I see those pillars, I know where I am. And um, let's go get some more wood. If I need wood. It's easier to, easier to gather stuff from a boat on the beach than to run around trying to tame a big dinosaur to do it. In reality, it, it takes time. You have to come up with, like that RG that attacked and killed my Pterodon, I can make a, uh, oh look, there's another damn fish. Uh, for that, I can definitely go ahead and, you know, I can make a trap once I get uh, stone dinosaur gates and stone dinosaur gateways, which takes a while to get to, that's all. But once I do that, I'm good. So what I do is just go around and well, I, I showed you guys in the in the last thing I did. I just go around doing my thing. See, crafting fiber. See fiber. Flint. Hide. Stone. More stone. Wood. Boom. I can make one of these too. Because I need that. Put some more fiber in there. I 
I didn't want to run out of hide, so I said, why well, I didn't make any more of these. Okay. Alright, oh, they're funny colors. Like I said, you hit certain areas on this map and the damn thing freezes, you need to have fur with you at that point. It's just hilarious. Okay, place this. I'll just place it over here. Kind of out of the way. And uh, put this in there. Put that in there. That'll give me about 15 ingots. Should be just enough to go ahead and get started. Make the smithy. Uh, what I'm going to do is, uh, let's see, let's put some of these down. Like this, like right here. Like this. Then I will leave that tree there and put this in integrated with the tree at an angle. Something comes from that direction and won't get through. If it comes up here, if it comes up here, it can be allowed to go in a little bit, like right there and right there. Oh, right there, right there, and it'll have to be like this. So it would have to fit in there very snugly. And then what I do is I can uh, put one here. Okay. So you see how I'm kind of telling it and making it into a little mini maze. So only an intelligent dino that can see where to go will know where to go and therefore get out of here without being hurt. See? So instead of having gates, which I can't even produce, I have those things to help deter anything from going in there. If they do, they'll die on the way in, taking damage. All right, time to run. Now, I'm not going to go down there where that Spino is because there's no way in hell I'm going to be able to do anything with that. But I can check this out and it looks like there's a trode on there. As long as I'm one with the boat, the trodon shouldn't attack. But those things are dangerous at night. Technically, I should go try to kill it now, but I'm not going to go into all that. Uh, it's another pterodon. I can try to tame him, have him as an interceptor. Can't do anything else with him. Hey, it's a level 14, which still ain't shit. I think I hit him too hard. My bad. I'll put him to uh to follow from a far distance. That'll be fine. Well, I'm waiting for him to tame up. Yeah, there's these funny lights all over the place here and these things, and I'm like, hmm. Let's see. Oh. It's funny, I haven't seen a raptor yet. 
Not one. See, if I didn't have that pterodon, that Argentavis, that big bird that came down, would have ate me without a problem. No problem at all. got two points suit I did put them up in there. Let's see. for a fiber normally I'll use a sickle there's another one Level five, it's even worse. See, last time I was having them follow because I was trying to keep them as riders. Now I'm just going to use them for defense, given the circumstances, you know. And I'm not building up the raft because I don't have the resources to do anything. There we go. Uh, you. Uh, hi. Neutral. So this guy will intercept anything that tries to get me. So this guy. That'll give me a chance to get the hell away. So, put out the fire. We got what I needed. And try to make a smithy. Need hide in the stone. Oh, those are hyena dons over there. The small hyenas. Oh, there's some. There's a stego. That's a real gatherer. So stego is a really good gatherer. Parasitium's good, but they're big. Uh, even the stego wouldn't be able to fit on the raft. But anyway, still good. some arrows there. So we got that, we got that. There we go. That was very difficult for no reason. Um, let's see what else. Oh yeah, the mortar and pestle. Only got two. Two spoiled meat. Got to go kill some more shit. Uh, 
Now this one you gotta place it far away. Otherwise every Tom, Dick, and Harry's gonna be in your shit, taking your stuff. Yeah. Alright. Okay, so we got the basics. Nothing fancy. This thing is not armored the way it should be. But it's something. Okay, so there's three creatures I can kill here. And the infamous Dodo. See? Those things are in the way, but they're also protecting the hell out of me. There we go. Boom, more resources. I could put them on highest if I really wanted to. See that? Split, split all. So I leave that those individual pieces of meat on my person and eventually it all spoils and I'll get about 80 pieces of meat. Look at that. Look at that. I got all this stone I could get. I'm trying to get my bearings in terms of things I'm familiar with that I think will make sense. Kind of, sort of. Because some of these things are natural bases. Um. See, they're my good luck charms. They're following me around. There's another one I can get right there. Okay, there's a raptor up there. Let's see. Got two narc. I knew I was getting close. Hello Christmas gotcha. I, I, I wish I could disable your ass. I wish I knew how to disable all the Christmas gotchas in the universe. They just suck. Okay. There's a raptor over there, or something. Oh no, here's uh, one of these guys. Aw, oh, poor Dodo thinks I'm trying to save him. Hey, Raptor. <laughs> this is what this is what I wish I had done over there in the other third episode. <laughs> Just killed the son of a bitch. But I should have bowled him and then killed him, not trying to attack him when I had like virtually no health left. Oh, hello. Hello.
So by the time I'm done, I'll have four babies. Follow me around, protecting me from the skies. Hmm, yeah, this place is confusing as hell. Uh... I'm getting good hide. Yeah, levels in this game always suck in the beginning, and then you have to do a dino wipe to get anything decent, but... It's fine. Uh, here's a couple of dodos. Gathering resources. Alright, let's get back to the boat. Plenty of stone here once I can get to actually making stone. Um. Can I make a pike yet? Crossbow pike is coming up. I'll just save my my points. So we got one, two, three. Alright. Yep, anything tries to take a nip at me and they die. So far, I almost got some narc handy. I mean, significant level of narc. Spoiling is happening. Glad I saved those blackberries. Try to save them if you can. And let's go back this way, I guess. I don't think I'm ever going to beat the boss at this rate, you know, but... <laughs> oh, I think it's too late. I think I should just, um, call it. Uh, I'll park somewhere and call it. And that way I can see if this thing is recording properly. I think it is. Oh, wow. There's another, uh... That raptor's probably going to attack that gotcha and, and uh, get attacked, so I'm just going to leave it be. Is that drop coming? Or is it already there? Uh, let's go for a rock here. I think it's coming down. I don't think it's actually there yet. Oh shit. Oh boy. I'm trying to increase their melee damage so that if they do attack, they do some damage. Oh wait, did I leave one over there? I'm supposed to have four. I'm counting three. Let me try this. Let me go back over there and see if I can find... I think I left one over there. I'm going to go grab him. <sighs> I'll tell you, I'm getting old. I'm so absent-minded nowadays. can't remember shit. Yeah, there he is. I see him in the distance. Yeah, he already tamed up.
There he is. Turtle will give you lots of keratin to where you can make a saddle, but these things are so low level. You know? There we go. So I should have four by now. I'm going to go over there and uh, I'm going to go try to get that green. Probably not jack shit in there, but yeah, it's already come down. I don't wonder why this thing seems so much slower than it did before. Maybe it's just me. Let's see. Where are my boys? Oh yeah, there they are. They're behind me. See, if I put them on the highest level, then they'll go way too far back and they may not even be able to intercept on time. So I just use high. Which is usually good enough. I don't see anything in the area. Maybe I can get in here. Oh, hello Mr. Trike. I am not going to mess with you even though you're just a level 12. I'm not going to put my boys on you. Um. Mm. I thought I saw something over there. But I only see there's the flapping of the birds. Oh shit! Oh shit, it's a freaking, oh man, <laughs> it's an, it's an aloe, come on, get out of my way, <laughs> get out of my way, <laughs> I can't believe the damn wings are in my way, that's an allosaurus, that thing will come after you and eat your face, and one of my boys is over there, look at him. Stuck in the damn tree. He's like, come help me. And it's like, no, you're dead. <laughs> you're dead. Stupid. Now, in order to get that Allosaurus, I would have to have a bunch of stone uh, parts to make the trap. Some narc, and then I can make him my bitch. But other than that, yeah, it's not going to happen. I think I went back a different way. Oh, no, there's my stone pillar. Or my wood pillar right there so I'm in the right area so that Allosaurus must be at the second level and of course there's another Argentavis there so what I'll do is I'll put this here the good thing is that when you turn this game off everything freezes in time and I'll take my babies over here all four of you idiots Getting in my way, messing with my head. And uh, we're back home, essentially. For these guys, I'm going to try to get them to go over the wall. Hopefully they can get over the wall. Okay, so we got all of them down. Safe. <laughs> Alright, we're far from the Allosaurus of death. And this is where we will uh, take a break. Small crop plot. Yeah, I don't even know what I can plant in there. Um, that's it. Alright guys, uh, I'm going to stop the recording. Hopefully this test is successful for the software because it is only 20 bucks. So I think it's called active exclamation point and it does seem to be pretty good so far. Um, if this thing is uploadable, if th things worked out, I'll go ahead and uh, I'll pick it up and uh, maybe continue the series. Have a good night. Video stop.